What are you smiling about? I was just thinking about how I could possibly repay you for bringing Arion home to me. I'm sure I could think of a few things. <laughs> Name your price, Mistyos. I want your lips. We have so much lost time to make up for. <laughs> That's a lot of kissing. Better get started. <laughs> your appetite is insatiable. <laughs> you've awakened a part of me I thought I'd lost. I know you've already done so much for me. But if there's just one more thing you could do... I'm not sure I can stand up. Arion wants to be a mighty warrior. But I can't lose any more of my family to war. If Arion learns to fight, he can protect you and the farm. I can't work this farm alone. He won't listen to me, but he looks up to you. I can see it in his eyes. <sighs> I'll talk to him. But I don't think he's as fond of me as you are. You flatter yourself. Just show him how to plant seeds, burn some old grass, maybe slaughter a few chickens. It will seem more exciting coming from you. Hello, Arion. Go away. I'm not talking to you. You don't have to talk. But you should listen. Hmm. I lost my father when I was young. I ran far, far away. My only friend in the world was Icarus. One day, a bully threw a rock and nearly broke his wing. What did you do? I cut off his fingers with this. The Spear of Leonidas? Can I hold it? You can, but first I need you to do me a favor. Your mother needs you. <gasps> You're going to train me to be a mighty warrior? I will. I think you'd both benefit from having someone around here who can fight. Uh, I'm going to be the fiercest warrior you've ever seen. I'll cut my enemies into pieces. Stay close and pay attention. I won't have you injuring yourself. First, a warrior must be resolute in their decision to kill. When you're face to face with the enemy, you cannot hesitate. Hesitation hastens the grave. My mother taught me that. How often should I train? All day. Every day. And when your hand starts to bleed, switch hands. Now we're going to find you a wooden sword. Here, this should do. If you're going to learn to fight, you need to use all your senses to anticipate your enemy's every move. How am I supposed to know that? By taking in the enemy before you, and trusting your instincts. Watch. I'm going to swing at you from the right side. I want you to defend yourself. Okay, I'm ready. Very good. I blocked the eagle better. I'm the greatest warrior who ever lived. Don't get cocky. The moment a warrior gets too proud is the moment they get cut down. This time, I'm going to attack you from the left. Bring it on! You lied to me! And you're not paying attention. Don't let what you hear 
distract you from what's actually happening right in front of you. What happened to the bully whose fingers you cut off? He went and got his brothers. They beat me pretty badly. You didn't have any friends to protect you? Not until one little girl stood between me and those boys, and with the rage of Ares, screamed at them to leave me alone. Really? A girl? Who? That little girl was me. Whoa, Mater! Alexios taught me to be a mighty warrior like him! He did what? You wanted me to teach the boy. I can't teach him what I don't know. But what I did teach him, he can... He can go to war and die like his father. Like my husband. I know you've been through a lot. But you can't protect the boy by living in the past. I, I thought bringing you here would help us have a better future. I, I thought if you showed an interest in the farm, he'd get excited and maybe give up on becoming a warrior. What's wrong of me to put that burden on your shoulders? I'm sorry. <laughs> 